Hi, Richard Apodaca with Uniweld Products. In an earlier video, we showed you how to repair aluminum coils. In this video, we're going to show you how to join an aluminum tube to a copper tube using Uniweld's Uni4300. Let's get started. We're going to use a copper access valve and with Uniweld's Uni4300 soft solder wire, form an O-ring around the copper tube. We then join this to the aluminum tube and prepare to soft solder the two tubes together. Here you see the copper access valve, the aluminum tube, and the preformed Uni4300 soft solder O-ring. You want to make sure that the tubes are free from oil and are clean. We're going to use the Uni4300 soft solder flux in this handy flux applicator with a metal tip. Given Uni4300's low application temperature of 500 degrees Fahrenheit, we want to preheat the tubes prior to applying the flux. First, we will preheat the copper tube and then proceed to preheat the aluminum tube. Next, we apply the Uni4300 flux to the joint. Once the flux begins to heat, we apply additional flux and with low heat, rapidly heat the entire assembly and we're done. We have now soft soldered the copper access valve to the aluminum tube using Uniwell's Uni4300. Let's go ahead and pressure test the joint we have soft soldered by connecting the access valve to Uniwell's RHP800 nitrogen regulator and apply 800 pounds of pressure to the assembly. Uniwell's RHP800 nitrogen regulator is ideal for meeting today's OEM stringent requirements for high pressure testing and purging. To test for leaks at the joint we have soft soldered, we will now submerge it in this tub of water. Using Uniwell's Uni4300, we were able to soft solder an aluminum tube to a copper tube and subjecting it to a pressure of 800 psi without any leaks. Be sure to ask for Uni4300 at your Uniwell authorized distributor. Thank you for watching. I'm Richard with Uniwell, quality tools that go to work with you.